With Kevin Lynch, Tom Hanneman back on a Timberwolves fast break following a 17-point Wolves win over the Lakers in Los Angeles. And with that win, the Timberwolves pull a half game ahead of the Denver Nuggets in that uh, race for the final playoff spot in the West. The headline story of this one, the return of Jimmy Butler, and boy, did he make a difference. Yeah, he was huge. I mean, uh, these, these wins are so important for Minnesota. Another loss could be really the death of their season in some ways as far as moving on to the playoffs, first time in over a decade. So Butler decides to play here tonight, and he looked great in limited minutes, played less than half the game, 18 points, four steals, was a playmaker, did some good things defensively. So, uh, yeah, if this team's going to get to the playoffs and maybe even be a factor once they get there, if they get there, Butler's got to be in the middle of it, kind of stirring everything up, and he was really good tonight. Timberwolves trailed by 12 points in the second quarter, turned things around in the third as we look at the final numbers, holding the Lakers to under 40% shooting in this game. After the win, Jimmy Butler addressed his defensive focus tonight. Defense is all, all about toughness, if you want to do it. I gamble a lot, but a lot of times I come up with those steals, uh, and then we started the second half the same way. Got to lead and maintain it. And then there were two, just two games remaining for the Timberwolves, both of them at Target Center. Memphis returns Monday, then on Wednesday, final day of the regular season, the Denver Nuggets, Nikola Jokic and company, in town. The Wolves have had problems for consecutive losses to the Memphis Grizzlies, a very big defeat at Target Center a little over a week ago. The Wolves owe them and they need to continue to win. Yeah, Towns is going to have his hands full the next couple games. Obviously, Marcus Gasol has given him problems before this season as well as previous seasons. And big skilled guy, big strong player like that, Nikola Jokic and Towns always kind of have an interesting relationship. Uh, banging heads a number of different times now with Denver and Minnesota. So I think if the Wolves can win these next couple games, I think Towns is going to uh, have to play well. We'll be back Monday night at 630 with Wolves Live from Target Center. Hope you'll join us then.